Um, it feels humbling just to know that the the pain that I went through as a child, as a teenager, as a young adult, um, that I'm that I have been, you know, through through faith and the help of God, like to transform that pain into power and purpose and to help other young people know that they're not alone, that they don't have to be embarrassed. They don't have to be ashamed. It's a part of their story, but now it's time to, of course we love our parents, but it's time to break generational cycles and, you know, pursue their purposes and their passions because we need, you know, we need the next generation of doctors and lawyers and right. Like all of the things that we need in society. Um, but there are so many barriers. Um, to education and, you know, whether you want to be a lawyer or a doctor, you've got to take all these exams and pay all this money that a lot of us just don't have. So when we come together as a community, it is so impactful. And so we, we're basically all pushing each other up together. Absolutely, because you're providing these kids an opportunity at an education that they wouldn't otherwise have, and that leads to a whole lifetime of possibility. It does. It really does. And the mentorship, you know, um, having people who, for example, young people who want to be pediatricians or OBGYNs, um, family lawyers, uh, uh, artists, all, all of the things, right, um, to have someone who has walked that path and who understands where they're at to be able to pour into them and then for young scholars to meet each other um, on the same, you know, they're the same age, they kind of going through the same things. It's just really impactful and allows them to not give up when it gets hard because it gets hard. <laughs> it does. And Danielle, you know, I want to bring you in here. How did you feel when you first heard about the work Yasmin was doing? Excited because it is what you said about taking that pain and translating that into a positive thing. And we see that she's a prime example of that. And we need people like her, and we need to support people like her. That's why I'm excited about CNN Heroes, and that's why I keep coming back, because I learn about uh, organizations like Scholar Chips that I can then um, help to promote or find money for and things like that. So I'm very excited for you and having this moment. I know it was not an easy feat getting here, um, so yeah, I'm excited to see what happens from here. So go support her.